Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Razor. So we're here in Falcon Dunes, and there's a notorious monster here. This will be the first one I show off in Valkram Dunes. This is Metal Shears. He spawns in this area. In this little forest area right here. J J6. Around around J6. And he's um I believe I believe over like 25 or something like that, around 25. So we might be able to handle him now, I don't know. I'm level 23, so we should be able to beat him, but he might be pretty tough. I know he has defensive abilities too, like, so this could be quite tough. But we're going to fight him anyway, win or lose. He spawns every 60 to 70 minutes in this area. Oh yeah, we got him. Yeah, this will be easy. He hit me for 74 though. Looks like X and Mile got aggro. Why is QP be not healing anybody? Yeah, he's got metallic body, which will boost his defense up, so... So we got him. Got 200 EXP and a state, state Elite Crab Shell. Let's check that out. This massive shell from a rare species of land crab is so hard it it feels like metal to the touch. Hmm. So for a level 25 enemy, level 25 in first monster, we weren't too bad, but we did have three other. It was four on one, so basically I would not have been able to solo him. Anyway, I'll see you. I'll see you in the next. I'll cut to the next enemy. I'll cut to the next notorious monster here in Valkyrie Dunes. Okay, I'm back and I'm here at the next notorious monster here in Valkyrie Dunes. This is Hippo Mar Atimus. He's a time spawn in this area right around here. Every 60 to 90 minutes. Um, let's go over the guide for him real quick. Sorry about that. Alright. Hold on a second, I'm finding it. Alright, for Ripple Martimus, he's a warrior with the lightning and ice. Strong against water. He's level 38, 2000 to 2500 HP. He drops channeling rogue 34%. It has 21 defense, adds 3 to MP, and increases damage of magic burst. So, let's go ahead and fight him. I'm level 42, as you can see. Warrior sub thief. So, we should have no problem killing him.
But he does have a lot of HP, so... Almost got him. As you can tell, he hits like a truck. Oh, he's dead. And we got the channeling rover drop, alright. So let's check that out. Yeah, right there it is. Looks like I said, 21 defense, 3 to MP, it's for level 34 plus. So that was Hippo Martimus. That was the second notorious monster here in Valkyrie Boons. There's two more here. The infamous Fulcrum Emperor. And then the Golden Bats, the other one, I believe. So I'm going to cut the video here. And I'll be right back whenever I spawn the next one. Okay, I'm back. And I got Valkyrie Emperor to spawn. All right. The famous slash infamous notorious monster, Vulcrum Emperor. I feel like this thing deserves its own intro. Hold on, let me turn my TV down. Mute my TV. Sorry about that. Alright, anyway. Nose tower here on the wide scan. There's a snipper here. And a thread leech here. Well, the... To spawn... Vulcan Emperor, there will be four damselflies in between Snipper and Thread Leech. So there would be four here. Four damselflies. Now, the first damselfly between these two, between the Snipper and the Thread Leech, is the one, is uh, Vulcan Emperor's placeholder. So. Basically, if there was four damselflies, he would be the one, on, the first one on the list. So, right around in here, right around in this area on the map. And the first damselfly between Snipper and Thread Leech is the placeholder. So let's go ahead and fight Vulcan Emperor here before he despawns, or before someone claims him. We should be able to kill him quickly, and I'll go over the guide for him after we're done. Alright, we killed Vulcan Emperor. He didn't drop the Emperor, Emperor, Empress headband, though. that's a shame. But anyway, the guide for Vulcan Emperor. He's weak to ice. He's levels 29 to 30. He drops Empress Hairband 16.5%. So that's probably why I didn't get it. Such a low chance of getting it. And he also drops the Insect Wing 100%. So, so that's three Notorious Monsters down for, for Vulcan Dunes. There's only one more here. And I believe that's called the, it's called the Golden Bat. Um, so I'm going to cut the video here until I spawn the Golden Bat and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back and I got the final notorious monster to spawn here in Balkram Dunes. This is the Golden Bat. It spawns from giant bats in this cave right here that I'm at now right here on the map. Fight giant bats inside this cave right here, this little cave, this little tunnel here. And there's also another tunnel down there, down that away, 
You can't miss it. You have to go through it to get back to Vulcrum Dunes. Or to get back... Basically to get back here. It starts right here and then it loops through. So you can't really miss it. But anyway, there's another giant bat. There's one giant bat here in this tunnel right here. And there's two giant bats in this tunnel that I'm at here. So, fight the one over in this tunnel. And then fight the two over in this tunnel. Until you spawn the golden bat. Now the guy for the golden bat is weak to wind, weak to wind and light. Level twenty six to twenty seven drops. Hold on a second, I didn't write that down. Hold on. Drops bat wing sixty six percent. Bat Fang 7.1%, Fiend Bud 3.8%, and Night Cape 28.2%. The Night Cape equips to the back. It has 3 defense, plus 3 dark resistance, plus 3 evasion, and it's for level levels 21 plus. So let's go ahead and fight Golden Bat here. This will be the final notorious monster and he's down already. And I got a fiend blood and bat wing from him. So we fought Metal Shears, we fought Hippo Martimus, we fought Valkram Emperor, and we fought the Golden Bat. That's all four notorious monsters here in Valkram Dunes. I want to thank you guys for watching. Be sure to check out my other guides on my channel. Please subscribe. Later.